Hi, this is Jesse Berg, owner and founder of the Visual Leap. Recently, I saw a post on the International Forum of Visual Practitioners by Roy Grubb in Hong Kong, who was asking, how would a blind person go about mind mapping? And uh, this was because an individual who was sight impaired needed to do mind mapping for a course that he or she was involved in. So I suggested we explore the audio preferences in inspiration because it has some things which may get us there. Not going to say it's easy or perfect, but I think there's room to explore within these tools. So the first thing I want to do is look at the listening tool. There's three in there that we'll get to, and I'll break this into three videos. So the listening tool we're going to start with. So as we click up into the utilities section of inspiration, we'll go to our preferences. Here we'll find several of our different preferences and these are the deeper settings in the program and in audio you'll notice that I've selected the listening tool okay it's selected and okay now you see that the listening tool is on the main menu of the toolbar I'll click it to engage it you'll notice that there's a little ear shape by the cursor now someone who is sight impaired would not necessarily be able to see that little ear but we're trying to figure out a problem here and, and, and we'll start like this. Maybe someone else can take it further once I'm done. So now I can click on these symbols and actually the program will read them back to me. Listen tool. Talking interface. Record sound. So here you see that the listening tool will at least allow someone who is sight impaired to hear what is on their mind map. Listen using tool. Talking interface, record sound, using inspiration software. So I'm going to dig a little deeper with some new tools, uh, the record sound tool and the talking interface, and we'll see if we can't at least put enough out there so that we can again uh, begin to address this very interesting problem of how would a sight impaired person use mind mapping as a learning strategy. Feel free to reach me at thevisualleap.com for any type of visual learning solution for education and industry. Thank you very much, and I hope this is helpful.